Hi, um, my name is Dee, and this is going to be another review on a product that I have been using lately, and, um, I bought this a couple of months ago, and it's called the, um, uh, it's from Bobby Brown. It's called, uh, the Bomb Rinse. Bobby Brown, Bobby Brown, Bobby Brown, comes in this box. Bobby Brown Bomb Rinse. And I do have autofocus, so it's pretty cool. Um, this is how it looks like. It's a big jar. It has... How much does it have? 7.3 ounces. So, it's a lot of product. And, um, this is uh, mostly geared for those uh, who have dry, dry skin. Um, cause I've noticed when I had some, um, I would wash my face with other cleansers. This, you can use this as a cleanser. Um, it would dry up my skin and my skin's already dry. So when I put, I would put foundation on, it would get really flaky. I could see like patches of dry skin and I've been struggling with dry skin for such a long time. And also I think it's my fault just because. Um, when I was younger, I really did not take care of my skin, and now I'm paying for it. So, if you're young, well, younger than I am, <laughs> um, I think it's very important to start taking care of your skin, um, washing it every night, because then you will pay, there are consequences then, until you get to, uh, become older like me, and you're like, ah, you pay for it, but it's all, I mean, there's a lot of stuff that can help you repair your skin, and so it's alright. Um, so like I said, um, it's like a balm. So every time, it's good for taking, removing dirt or anything, makeup. Um, you just rub it around. It's it's like Vaseline. It's that consistency. Let me get some. Let me show you. So it's, it's like a, what's, uh, what's it called again? It's like, it's a balm rinse. So it's like jelly. It's like a... Vaseline, like I mentioned, and watch, I'll just show you once more. Let's see, I'm out of the camera. It smells so good. It's like um, citrus, uh, made more like a lemon lime. Um, so this is what you do: you rub it around your face, and it removes makeup awesome this is awesome I also have another makeup remover um, but this this I love this because it's good for like I said getting back to the main reason on um, I bought this I have really dry skin so wait after before I get to that um, so you rub it and then you rinse and then like normal you pat your face dry um, I use paper towels like um, those bounty to dry my face and I have this padded just because washcloths do not work for me and I, I think it's I mean I'm not gonna be washing every single day and I don't I'm not gonna be, I don't have time to be washing my washcloths every single day so that's so like I said you rinse it off and your skin feels so smooth and you start noticing um I don't use it every day just because um I did start doing that because I did have really dry skin and then maybe after a week I started noticing it was like not oily, but I my the texture of my skin started to change, and my foundation looked much better. So maybe after your skin starts getting a little bit better, not as dry, maybe use it uh, every other day, or as how you find like however your skin starts to um, if you think it's getting too crispy, we'll stop using it and don't use it as often. But it's really great. I really recommend it, and it's well, it's geared for dry skin, and they do have like line for dry skin. And I didn't know that. Um, I re I was looking for the under eye concealer, but they didn't have my shade. After they tried it on, and I'm like, oh, you know, I'll take it. And they're like, well, um, we actually don't have your shade. So, so I bought this. Oh, the price. I think it was forty five bucks for this. But it's a big jar. I mean, I've had it, like I said, for a couple of months, maybe four months. And you just need a little bit. Like, so good you guys are gonna ugh, it smells great they do have another one and I think it's uh it comes in a tube and maybe if you I got they can give you samples I'm sure you know but where I live 
I drove somewhere else um, to visit my brother, and that's the only place, the only Macy's that has um, a Bobby Brown. So I'm like, I'm gonna take it, you know. And if I don't like it, I guess I can just give it to my brother, or whatever. He can change it or something like that. But um, I'm sure they can give you a sample, or you can get the smaller one. I'm not sure how much the smaller one costs. Maybe like 20 bucks around that price. Um, and it's a really great product. Like I said, what else? can I say about it um, so you can actually use a cleanser to take off your uh, makeup I sometimes use this excuse me sorry should have been prepared okay I sometimes use this the Vino okay the Positively Radiant Makeup Removing Cleanser. And it's a good one. I mean, Avino has really good products. But it didn't quite remove all my makeup. Um, so you can use this and maybe then afterwards, this is what I did just to finish it up. I still have a little bit. I would use this and maybe get some of the other one, uh, the Bobbi Brown um, balm, balm. And rub it around, you know. You'll notice when, you know, it's ready to come off. And then just rinse it and you'll see the difference. You're, is, this product is amazing and like I said, it's pricey. But it's going to last you a long time. And um, I hope this review was helpful. And I actually bought other items of Bobbi Brown that I think I'm going to be reviewing. Um, I didn't check if there's any reviews on this but I'm sure just take a look and they're extremely helpful I find all of YouTube videos extremely helpful before I, I make a purchase so but sometimes you do have to take a chance um, so this is what I did because before I didn't find a review on this so I'm like I said this for dry skin and this is what I got and um so thanks a lot for watching and I hope this review is helpful and I hope I didn't miss anything else. I did say the price. Um, $45, right? What else can I say? I showed you the consistency. Uh, for dry skin, it works really well. In my foundation, I can apply it w better. Um, before, I wasn't able to... <sighs> you know, they tell you certain foundations are certain for certain skin types. But if you have dry skin, and it's, maybe it's just me or maybe somebody has... I don't have similar uh, difficulty finding a foundation. They tell me, oh, you know, cream foundation is good or this type of liquid foundation is good. And I always find it, um, I always found it like flaky or patchy around. And as long as I guess you don't take care of that dry skin or try to make it better, well, for, for my, in my, for, in my personal um, experience, no foundation works for me, so it would work for me, even if I applied it a certain way, you know, I found that the best way if you have do put liquid foundation is just to dab, and I know it gets a bit more of a, um, coverage, heavy coverage, but the thing is, that's the way it worked for me, and afterwards I did get a sponge, and I tried to cheer it out, I had studio tech and that was that worked really good at first but then it turns orange i am wearing um the makeup forever with um a concealer that you know i'm trying to find my perfect concealer but i use this one it's the mac moisture not moisture suck it's the mac select it comes in a little tube i think it's great for um you know blemishes or so i hope you found this review helpful and for those of us or for those who share the same experience as me that have dry skin i truly recommend this and get a sample or even the tube because it is pricey i mean come on i i got around my macy's card to be honest. i didn't i was like okay because i took four items that day and then i paid it off of course but so it's it's pricey and it's pricey i'm not gonna lie but look at this is a lot of product and it works it's gonna work for you it worked for me and I had really really bad dry skin so I hope you found this helpful and if you have any questions regarding this uh, uh, 
this product just let me know thanks so I'm just doing a close-up so you guys can maybe see I just washed my face actually I took a shower and um, and then I cleaned my face with it and I, I just like after I when I put my makeup on and I, I love it because it gives me like a like a natural glow and this is what I always wanted I mean my skin is getting better still not perfect it's not gonna get perfect but um, it's looking better so that's all I can ask for and um, hope you guys can I mean you, there's no before or after but just wanted to show you that what how my skin looks um, I just have some liquid foundation on and there you go. Thank you.